Okay, shooting on a new camera and new lens. This is a Sony FX30. I'm shooting on an 11mm f1.8 lens, so it's a little bit wider, so I gotta get used to this. Like, is it clear there? Is it clear there? I don't know. Got this brand new Starfield controller. Let's uh, check it out. Did you know we definitely had to cinch this guy out? We added a ton of stuff. It comes in this really cool box, and uh, these are gonna ship in these boxes too. So, it has this really cool back textured grip I'll show you here. It's different. This controller comes equipped with mouse click triggers, instant shooting, and they are clear with a cold trigger rumble, which obviously we have to disconnect to make the mouse click triggers work, but it's really, really cool looking. Also has this custom back here with some uh, Starfield logos on it and some information. And then it looks like on the front, these are actually there's some, uh, some icons mapped to the direct controls. So it looks like that's gonna do that in the game and so forth. Uh, really cool. Also has two back buttons, and these are a little bit more low profile than we usually ship on our controllers, and I'll show you why. So this back grip on this guy is a little bit thicker than um, the normal back. So in order to get the buttons to work, we did some extra um, grinding and shaving and really made them fit nicely, but it's really low profile. And I'll be honest, I kind of like these buttons a lot, and a lot of the builders do too, so we might offer something like that down the line. Uh, maybe a new button style or a shorter button head. The gold D-pad is really clean. It's kind of ex-NASA space design on the top there. Uh, red and gray thumbsticks, really unique. And um, yeah, this controller is just really, really cool. And plus, like I said, it comes with a box and that design matches the same design on the controller there. These are sold out on Microsoft.com, by the way. I don't know if they're ringing them back either, but they are 100% sold out. We are moving some stuff around. We have three new hires over at Cinch. So we are moving stuff around. Uh, Josh's desk, or Daddy Josh, people call him in the videos, is going right here. Um, mine is gonna go right here behind him. We did get him a brand new Mac Mini M2, and I beefed up the RAM on it. Works good, because we're not doing any like insane video edits, but it does work nice, and he's right by the window. So it's kind of what a station looks like. Headphones, although we mostly edit on the monitors. Um, some Rode mics charging up. We also have the Anchor Work mics, which honestly I prefer. And we would be using all customs keyboard and mouse, but we're on Mac, so we had to use some Mac specific stuff. My desk is in the middle over here. Uh, I'm building a new desk tomorrow. In fact, the same one as he has. And our new customer support guy, Randy, which is killing it, he's gonna be taking my desk. This lens is kind of wide, I kind of like it. Looks, looks nice, it's a little different than my normal lenses. We did get a new lens in yesterday too, somewhere. Right here, we got a new 35 millimeter f1.8 uh, on the a7C, great for TikToks. Looks really nice, that's the primary camera Josh uses. He'll probably switch to this FX30 that I'm using now, probably like tomorrow. I'm just kind of doing a test today with some S-Log. Here's our like video content cart, there's stuff everywhere. We got an 85 mil to uh, one, or f1.8 lens there too. We got some kit lenses. This is a 28 to 70, I think. And we got this kit lens on the a7 III. Considering selling the a7 III, but I think we're gonna keep it because with more people joining the office, we're gonna need more cameras. Um, and it's like, that's a lot of what we do here is content, so. Also got me a new chair, because mine broke. It keeps going down by itself, so I did, I can get a kit to fix it, but I thought this would be kind of a nice new chair. Um, also, these mats are still selling like crazy. This is the car mat. So if you're interested in getting one of these, they're selling like crazy. Got some posters over here, people ordered different stuff. Keycaps, just got some big keycap shipments in, so we're going through sorting. We got a lot of alt refurbs gonna go up on the alt customs website, so stay tuned for that. You can get some refurbished gear. A lot of it's brand new, honestly, just customer returns that weren't even open. But we're gonna sell those refurbs. Got some alt boxes being built up, and then um, new shipment of these in a couple days. And then we have some new keyboard we're launching too. Today was probably our biggest shipment in a long time to USPS. I mean, I don't know if I showed you earlier, but there was hundreds, I mean, it was so many packages, it filled the entire mail truck up. But yeah, that is the Starfield controller. It's pretty sweet. Um, big changes going down here in the office. We're actually looking at a new house for me and the wife and then expanding the office building out. So that is, our next project is getting more space for us in here because we are running out of room. Um, and remember, if I can move this, sex is temporary, cinch is forever. I will see you guys in the next video probably tomorrow, and keep an eye out for these Starfield controllers on the website, because once they're gone, they're gone, and they are pretty rare.